A small Oregon town is celebrating its first legal pot shop. It opened this morning in Malala. That's about 30 miles south of Portland. But as Ashley Corslin from our sister station KGW reports, not everyone is happy about this. Supporters say that revenue from the pot shop is going to help the area's struggling economy, but opponents say this town doesn't need this type of business. A steady line of people filled the inside of Shango Malala. I'm probably going to buy some shatter. I like smoking that stuff. It's quite a sight for this small town of less than 9,000 people. I'm here to welcome a new business to Malala. Even the mayor, Deborah Raggi, was there. This enables them not to drive quite as far to get their, their marijuana. Two grams of the premium. Shango's owner, Joy Moshberger, says her business will benefit the city. You know, we're going to hire locally. We're going to use local merchants. She says Malala could potentially get 3% of tax revenue to be used for things like education and emergency services. I thought it would be a really positive thing for the community. But the mayor is cautiously optimistic. Yeah, I don't know what the sales volume is going to be. I don't know what the impacts are going to be. We're kind of pioneering. Uh, yeah, come in with a hidden camera. One thing is certain. Many people are not happy about the new business venture. I don't necessarily have to like it. Like the customers across the street who couldn't find a parking spot at their local barber shop. It was not good. I had to park down the street. Jeff Early isn't excited one bit about Shango Malala. You no, know, it's a sign of the times, I guess. I just assumed it didn't open. Ashley Korslin, King 5 News. So here's a breakdown of how much tax money is being collected from recreational marijuana sales in Oregon. In January alone, the state collected $3.48 million, much more than was expected. Most of the tax money will go to schools. Meanwhile, new research shows legal marijuana sales in our state totaled more than $709 million in 2015. That's more than 30 percent over 2014, according to market research firm ArcView. They also estimate national sales of marijuana totaled $5.6 seven billion dollars last year it's up from 4.6 billion in 2014.